The relevance to the business sector of the Master of Laws in Compliance and Regulation has been recognised by the government in its first round of funding for a scheme that it started in 2020. The objective of the scheme is to promote priority areas of development for Hong Kong and to promote the development of innovative and multidisciplinary tertiary studies. I myself come from the private sector. By learning from the other fellows who come from the public sector, I started to gain insights and exposure into new areas such as the policy and practice in the public administration system that reinforces my aspiration to get to know more like-minded insiders of the financial sector and to connect with those who share similar ambition with myself to educate the next generation and equip future compliance leaders. The fellowship program is not, not like a course, not like a lecturer who have a specific target. But once you put some input on it and you have the ability to interact with people from different backgrounds, you actually get more insight from people who, who think differently from you. And people from the fellowship is all from public sector and private sector and we all, all think about it and we do think that, oh, that is something that we actually miss. So that's one of the value add from the fellowship program. The way the scheme works is that eligible local students will be able to obtain up to 120,000 Hong Kong dollars reimbursement on their tuition fees. We hope that CR Fellows will become flag bearers not only for the program, but also for the values expressed by the government's support for the Compliance and Regulation Programme.